Yeah. Good morning, little man. Did you have a little morning bath? Morning bath time for Abram. Hey, buddy, stick it out. <laughs> degrees below freezing I'm so cold I'm all bundled up this was my snow jacket the one time I ever went to the snow with Sam kind of on our honeymoon I'm here to bring wreath boxes and I have so many which means I'm gonna be going in and out of the cold and yes I'm whining about it because I don't like being cold the post office guy that's working the window he was like I don't work up here that often so it's gonna take a while I hope you're not in a hurry so he's doing the boxes and I am over here getting the PO box so I'm gonna check it real quick you guys ready I was trying to mix up some paint to get the color of these flowers. I think I got pretty close. What do you guys think? What do you think, Sam? Is it a little too light still? It's just that some of the petals are really light. Yeah, it looks like the lighter petals on there. That looks good. I think it might need a little more gray or black added to it. I mixed three different colors to get this. You got a little helper over here. <laughs> you helping Nia? Reese by Nia and Annie. <laughs> My first employee. Pretty identical. Good job. You think so? Yeah, mixing paint is hard. It is hard. My aunt sent me a picture of what her dog might look like when she grows up. Aww. I think that's her dog. I think she has a black nose cur. Good morning, guys. Today, I am off to go do my second interview. I already got the job, but they still want me to go do the second interview. Kind of interesting, huh? I guess it's not really an interview. It's going to be just kind of a meet and greet the uh, other employees. These diapers are helpful, but do you know what's so stupid about them? There's a hole. Look, right where poop comes out. Right on her butt. So it doesn't block poop. She has to go poop. Goes on the, half on the floor, half in the diaper. Or most on the floor, a little bit in the diaper. Come on, Abram. Oh my goodness, how cute. <laughs> Annie's getting a ride through the house. Hold on, Abram, she can take a turn. And then you'll get it back. Bring it this way. <laughs> okay, let Abram have a turn. Bring, it, Leave it in the kitchen. So I'm going through some of the mail from you guys. Sam has the packages in the car, so we'll be opening those a little bit later. But this letter is from Cheyenne. And I just thought the front of it was really cute. I wanted to show you guys. Oh my gosh, she wrote something so sweet. I'm not going to read the whole letter, but one thing she wrote was, thank you for being my internet mom. That is so precious. It just means a lot to me. I never thought that anyone would look at me that way. And that means a lot to me. It makes me feel like I have a bigger responsibility as a blogger to be even better of an example than what I might already be. So thanks for the challenge, girls. So how did it go? It good. What were you? So you did get a haircut. Yeah. Trickster, yeah, I could tell when he came and I was like, oh, you got your hair cut. And he yeah. didn't say anything. I was like, did you get your hair cut? He's like, no, but it looked like he did. So I was just like, I don't know. They just didn't cut it short enough. Oh, okay. Yeah, I feel really naked now. <laughs> I was trying to feel more naked. That's so anyways, how did it go? The haircut went great. They um, just clipped some off the sides. She just kept going and going and going. Kept going and going and going and going. You know, you know how they do it. Yeah, so anyway, how did the interview go? They got the little texture scissors. Oh gosh. And put those in there add yeah, a little bit of texture. Yeah, tell us about your hair. Interview. Okay. Yeah. Come here. Give me a hug. Come here. Get over here. Give me a hug. It's not funny. Give me a hug. Get over here. Cause you liked it up there. Jump. 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 Come on, jump. Let's see if she'll jump off. She can't do it. Why can't she do it? She's just a baby. 
Do you want to go give her a bubble mommy. bath? Huh? Do you want to give her a bubble bath? Yeah. You want to take one with her? Yeah. Tonight. Oh, you guys, the love just doesn't end. It's so sweet. So this is the Bridgman Bunch, and she wrote, I recently started watching your channel. I YouTube Christian Mom, and there you were. Oh, my gosh. Like, that is such an honor. That is so sweet. Try Googling Christian Dad and see what comes up. <laughs> do it. Do it, guys. So the other night, I woke up with a huge knot in my calf muscle. Have you guys had that happen to you where the, your calf muscle just kind of curls up or like knots up on itself and like sends this wave through your calf muscle? It was so painful. I screamed from the bedroom in pain. Nia came running in there. She was really scared for me, weren't yeah, you? Yeah, I was. I was like, what is going on? He was screaming like extremely loud. It's my gastrocnemia. Yeah, it's like really bad. Whoa. And then it happened again right after it went away and then it just like came back. Like, I think it's like the worst pain I've ever had. Hey, you guys, check out my loot from Charlene. She made this for me. What is this, sis? What? <gasps> what? Wow, who sent you this? Look, it comes with a bracelet. I got a car. Aww, Daddy, let me look see. what's on it. It's a snowflake? Yeah. Look at that. Elsa Aww. and Anna's on the little, on the whole bag. That is so pretty. Who is this from? Let me see here. From Evie Lancaster. Thank you, Evie. That was so sweet. She wrote in the letter that it was um, friendship jewelry. This other candy. Oh. Bubble wrap, baby. You guys, look at this awesome stuff from Haley Lopez and Megan. These smell amazing. They sent Symphony some really awesome books. And this handmade stuff. This is like a platter, a ceramic platter. This stuff is from Brianna. She sent the kids some books and some crafts. This stuff is from Anna or Anna. There's some German snacks in here. I cannot wait to try the toffees. Some little leggings for Abram. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Thanks, thank you, guys. guys. I cannot believe you guys sent us a plate. That's awesome. With salmon on it. We should have, we gotta make a salmon wall now. Sam and the kids. Bye, baby. I love you. Aww, it's kind of sad he's become like okay with me leaving the house. This is fairly new. Symphony and I are reading books. We just read this one, A Fly Went By. What a good book that is. Abram's got a good one too over here. We do not want you in the zoo. Out you go. Out, out with you. Why did they put me out this way? I should be in. I want to stay. Oh, they would put me in the zoo if they could see what I can do. Good job. And I can put my spots on. Yeah. And you. And you. What happened? Ooh. The book fell. Everyone was really upset that mommy left. So I turned on Elmo for him. Here's his reaction. And Dorothy has a question. When I'm going to tell it, we see. Okay, so Mama. I'm Mr. Doodle. That's a ball. <laughs> Mama. Hi, Mama. That's what I was thinking about today. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You can get this hair off my shirt. Who is being a birthday noise maker? It's puppy attack time. Oh no, here we go. <sighs> it's a matter of seconds before I get attacked. No. Well, Nia's still at her Bible study, guys. I just put down the kids. Abram was so precious putting him down. I just love putting him to bed. Every time I do, it's just such a blessing and just, uh, it's just so precious. So my big special something is coming up tomorrow. Several of you guys got it, but there's one person that got it first and they're gonna get the FaceTime with us. If they don't get it, we'll just go to the next, if they don't um, answer or respond, um, we'll just go to the next person who got it. So I'll uh, be back tomorrow to see what that is. Because yes, it will be announced tomorrow. I'm not gonna announce it yet, so. Tomorrow, it's going to happen. It's going to be so much fun. But anyway, guys, thanks for coming along with us again. Don't forget, we love you. And remember to love each other. I'll be the hand that you can't hold.